Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. We got a special set in today. Usually in my area we don't get uh we don't get things first and it's nice once in a while, you know, we get something nice. Uh I'm still waiting on that boulevard uh WRX STI. Uh it seems like it it's been all around the area and not in my actual city, but uh I got a couple of trades coming up that uh, will fulfill that need. All right, so what do we have here today? We have um, these Deutschland German German cars. And what's kind of funny is that uh, this set is German based, and there was a guy on my Instagram that was like, "I can't wait for it to show up in Germany." I'm like, "Wouldn't it make sense to release it there first? I don't know. <laughs> But yeah, let's check it out. So we'll check them out real quick and then we'll, we'll pop them open, all right? Um, usually I buy two sets, one I keep carded and one uh, when I uh, open up, but uh, I find that uh, it, that takes up way too much space, you know? And Hot Wheels is just pumping this stuff out, so. And other die-cast uh, manufacturers, they're just pumping stuff out. So here's the BMW M3 E46. And then we got this Porsche Rendiz. That's, uh, I think that, that means uh, race, race service or something like that. And they used to have these to service the Porsches, I'm assuming. This Porsche 959. It's, uh, this is like the other Porsche that was released in the car culture set. We actually didn't get that set uh, in my, in, in Canada, I believe. Um, but I'm happy to get this one. This one's a lot cleaner anyways. The other one was like blue, white. Uh, it was a typical um, uh, livery that they had on these. Uh, it's uh, actually a smoking livery. It's a, uh, this actually, I'll show you guys real quick. I got this custom that was made, uh, Rothmans. It was a Rothmans livery, but obviously since Hot Wheels is a toy, man, uh, toy uh, for kids and stuff, they, they can't have that. <laughs> I believe they would be, wouldn't be too good for their reputation to have smokes, cigarette manufacturers on there. Um, Mercedes-Benz 300 SL, SLE, sorry, sorry, S-E-L, <laughs> anyways, and this is pretty neat, Naughty S4 Quattro, alright guys, let's, uh, let's get this open, we'll just go in order, we'll just go in order and, and then check it out, and uh, we'll get our turntable out here. get our turntable all set up today is Friday so the weekend is upon us for some for me it's not really because uh, my job is I always have to be available so well not always but you know you guys know some jobs they're not Monday to Friday all right so we're looking at the BMW M3 E46 um, this was in the white before with the green rims, which I have right here. We'll do a quick comparison shortly after, but they look um, relatively the same. I actually like this blue. It's actually really nice, nice and clean and simple. Yeah, this one's beautiful. This one came out pretty much back to back. Uh, this was released not too long ago, so. There it is, side back to back, side to side, whatever you want to call it. Sorry, side to side. <laughs> I'm just being silly tonight. Um, yeah, same rims actually, just a complete recolor of the whole car. Pretty cool. Well, that's been it. I'm going to open up the next one, which is going to be the T1 panel bus. The Porsche Race Service Rendins. Now, I'm not usually a big uh, T1 panel bus or VW fan, but uh, this one says Porsche on the side. That's pretty sweet, you know? That's pretty cool. I like that. This one's nice and clean too, all in red. Yeah, it's nice and clean. The real one, uh, instead of the, what do you call it, the bumpers are, are white, 
They're painted white, but I guess Hot Wheels wanted to save some money there. Which is kind of weird, because usually their premiums, they could kind of go all out. But, uh, yeah, it still looks really good. Really, really clean looking. All right, let's get, uh, let's get a Porsche beside it. I'm going to open up this Porsche 959. Now this is like a rally style Porsche because uh, it does rally racing. So it is a little bit on the uh, jacked up for the, for the stance. Um, I hate how they have this gap there. It's really annoying for the offset. But uh, yeah, it's still a nice Porsche to add to the collection. Still a nice clean Porsche to add to the collection collection nice little race window there with a the little slot cut out pretty cool i have no idea what this these things up here are so if somebody could explain that to me that'd be cool but yeah looks pretty neat very neat all right well, i'll leave that up there and then uh, i'll get my favorite one out of the bunch maybe my favorite one this one and the this one on the Audi A4 is going to be pretty debatable. That's my favorite casting out of the set here. But this set is actually pretty amazing. Nice clean cars. Uh, this is the Mercedes Benz 300 SEL uh, 6.8 AMG. We've seen this in the all black, which I have here. I'll, I'll throw it up on the table with it in a second. And it's amazing how uh, they look so different. Um, with like the, the other one being completely black and this one's completely raced out with all this Declan. It's crazy. Little Hot Wheels symbol on the front fender there near the lights. And it has a, it, the, the grill is actually a little bit different. It has a whole bunch of lights compared to the black one, which is, uh, doesn't have all those lights in the front. So that's cool that they, they do that. Um, and then the bumper on this one is missing as well. Uh, where the other one does have its bumper. Might as well throw it on there and you guys can see. And one's, I believe the black one's a little bit lower. But I believe it's the same casting. Yeah, it's the same casting. Just a little bit of a different grill setup. Bumper setup on front and back. Yeah, primarily that's what's going to be the, the, the difference here. And obviously the rims and way it's colored and stuff but everything else is pretty much the same oh no you got your uh your tags in the back they flipped one's on the right the other one's on the left it's switched around pretty cool though they look really really good together all right let's get out the a4 audi a4 i love this car since i was a kid. Oh, sorry this is an s4 yeah same same thing this is a performance version, obviously. But yeah, I always uh, thought this car was really nice looking. Um, and it obviously performs really well as well. As well, 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 as well. <laughs> yeah, and this one's not disappointing. A little bit of uh, paint missing on the back fender there. Hard to tell when uh, you're not zoomed in like this. But yeah, it looks pretty good. I'm not disappointed at all with this thing. Rims look nice. Everything is nice and clean. Just a nice, clean example of an Audi S4. Pretty sweet. I'm going to, let me see. I'm going to pick up my favorite one. Uh, the, they're all pretty clean. I'm going to have to go, uh, I'm going to have to go with this Mercedes being first. And then I like this Audi second. And then, uh, you know, honestly, this BMW, they did a really good job with this BMW. So this is my one, two, three pick right here out of the set. Yours might be different. It doesn't matter. I think you guys should definitely grab this set up if it's available in your area. And if it hasn't been completely scalped. <laughs> but you can buy it from them. They're not hoarders. They're scalpers. So it's all good. But this set is definitely worth picking up. 
These cards are gorgeous. They did a really good job with the card art too as well. It's very colorful. All right, guys. Thanks for checking out this set with me. Um, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.